another amazing car. Now this car isn't going to hang about for a simple reason, you just don't get them. They're just so hard to get hold of in the perfect combination. This one is a 2019 19 registration Range Rover Autobiography Dynamic with 33,000 miles on in a beautiful metallic black with the ivory interior and the autobiography is fully loaded. This is a 3 litre SDV6 with 306 brake horsepower but look at it. It's absolutely mega in every single way. The whole colour combination, the way it looks, it's very stealthy. It's a big four-wheel drive, lots of road presence, super comfortable, and it is luxurious in every single way. And then you have loads of gadget and gizmos. But like the inside, the outside tells a story as well because it's the way it's finished with the big bumpers, the LED daytime running lights, the full adaptive LED headlights, all the black styling pack, which are the, the black badges, grills, bonnet vents, side vents. This one's got the LED lights right at the bottom and because it's the autobiography, this bottom section is all colour coded as well. Another couple of big things, because on the Range Rover Sports, like the Range Rover Vogue, the adaptive cruise control is not standard on most of the cars. Now this one has got adaptive cruise control, which is brilliant. You've also got the 360 view camera system. That's the front camera, the side cameras and rear camera. If you look at all the Range Rover Sports that are available, which aren't less in value to this one really, you're just getting a lot more because when you're buying a car like this, you really want to enjoy it every single day. And then you've got them wheels, genuine 22 inch upgraded alloy wheels, finished in jet black, which fills the arches as you can see, the way it sits. At the minute, this car is at an access height. The reason behind that is so you can get in and out at ease without having to climb up to it. But to help you again and to aid you, this car's got fixed side steps as well. The full side skirtings, all color coded. Obviously, comfort access, electric folding mirrors, some protection glass, and then another big thing is a full tilt and sliding panoramic roof. But then look at this interior. First thing you see is that amazing ivory leather interior with the perforated seats, electric seats, memory seats, and number support. The illuminated entry kick place, and then boom, you get hit with the ambient lighting. The ambient lighting is everywhere on the center dash, near the cup holders, the door cards. It's everywhere, but it looks brilliant because if you go and buy yourself a HSC or HSC Dynamic, they don't have ambient lighting. And when you're buying a car of this level, you want that finish because it looks brilliant. Touchscreen media system, you've got digital TV, heated seats and ventilated seats. And because of the autobiography, you've also got the fridge in the armrest. The full roof lining is Alcantara. The back seats are also equally the same, look at the comfort level. You can just look at something and think, you know what, that looks super comfortable, because it does. You've got the third zone climate control, you've got the rear heated seats for your rear passengers, 12 volt sockets, USBs, everything. The extended speaker system in the back and the ambient lighting continues there, also on the footwells as well. Around the back, the same thing happens. The black styling continues, the autobiography badging, rear LED lighting system with the sweeping indicators. The bigger exhaust system here and the rear diffuser is completely different again to give it a more sportier look to it. Automatic tailgate, a very nice generous boot, the partial shelf comes out all together if you have got pets and then you can't really ask for much more. Spare wheel there, only a dinky one but better than nothing and the condition is key to look at this car because I always say this black cars are one of the best cars in the world because they look amazing but they're quite hard to keep clean, that's, that's honest, that, that's the truth. But this one's been very well looked after. There's no swirls or scratches or marks inside or outside. It has been well looked after. Hazard warning lane assist there as well. Electric windows and mirrors with electric folding mirrors. And then you have here the beautiful steering wheel, which is an autobiography upgraded version. The heated steering wheel. There's adaptive cruise control, stereo controls and voice control. You've then got the full digital dash there, which you can display the navigation on there, or you can have it as dials for your rev counter and your speedo. Touchscreen media system where you have the ambient lighting, the Bluetooth sections, and then the rest of the media side of stuff. A big question we get asked all the time is, has a car got Apple CarPlay and in-control apps and Android Auto? Yes, it does. You see heating system and sort of climate control and heated seats. Twin cup holders, more cubby hole space down there, and you've got the fridge, as I mentioned earlier, with two settings. With the Alcantara roof, being sat high up like this, you feel brilliant because you're on top of the world. You get good running costs for the size of the car, the engine is super smooth and they are literally mega 
this autobiography dynamic is not going to hang around for all the correct reasons. 33,000 miles, 2019, 19 registration. My name's Joe. My name and number's on the bottom of the screen. If you like what you see, call me direct. I don't, don't care what time it is. I'll do my very best to help you. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye now.